Hey guys, so for this video I'll be showing an unboxing of uh, Vix's um, second single in their, um, what's it called, uh, Conception series. Um, this is Hades, and this is obviously the style I like more from Vix. I love the darker um, electronic sounds. I did really enjoy Dynamite, and I also ordered that, but that's not here yet. So, um, I found this at a good price, so I... Went, in, went ahead and got it. I collect VIX. Um, usually in my channel, I mostly show you guys like uh, Don't Buy Shinky and um, SM Group. So, just so you know, I, col I also collect VIX. I just really never really talk about them on my channel. And I really love what um, Jellyfist did this year. I don't mind um, having the, like to buy singles because they usually come with like two tracks that are really solid which are not if they don't um usually make it into the full length album because what jellyfish what jellyfish does um is include the singles they released previously and do the um place them as bonus tracks on their full length albums um well that's what they've done the, for the past and if it doesn't fit the album um they usually don't include it so for last year i think they did chained up and they didn't include the single um, Love Equation into um, the album because it just didn't fit the sound of it, which I think was really smart. Uh, but usually they do include the single. So if you just want Fantasy, I would just either wait um, a year because I think we'll probably get a full-length album next year and it will include the three lead singles for... Um, that for this year into that album so other than that than explaining that um also order the jellos album so that'll come at, that will come in soon and i'm gonna make an unboxing of that but this is haiti so this is a slip cover and this is what the back looks like um and it comes with three tracks fantasy love me do and nabi um, yo, and an inter and the fourth track is an instrumental. And to make a quick comparison to a jewel case, since everybody knows the size of a jewel case, um, here's how big the album is, so you can get an idea of the size. Uh, I really, really like these dark rounds. So, here's the first page. I think the member that fit the members that fit these dark concepts the best are like Leo, like Leo and 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 N. Like so, Robbie has a really good body. <laughs> okay, I recently posted on my Google Plus. I want like a fix LR comeback. So please, Jellyfish, make it happen next year. I need another, like, Beautiful Liar, because that song, <sighs> life-changing. I'm really curious what the next song is going to um, sound like. So here's a photo card I got. You get um, this ad from Jellyfish, and of course I got N, so I'm really happy I have him, because usually for these darker concepts, he's the one that impresses me the most. And for like CD, um, CD plays, I always get Hanbin, so it's nice to have someone differently, someone different. <laughs> so here's what the back looks like. So I got N. Let me put him right here, so you can stare at N if you want to. Okay, here's lyrics for "Love Me Do," which was composed by. Um, I mean, written by. Uh, I thought it was Ben Young Gook. I don't know why. Who's, who said it was Ben Young Gook? Maybe I'm just crazy. <laughs> More uh, pictures of Raleigh. Let me do such a good song as well. 
it's easier to listen to than fantasy. Like fantasy, I could listen to it, but when I'm in like the mood for it, since it's such a big song, let me do is listen easier to listen to. As for their next single, I think it's probably going to drop like in late November, latest early December. Because obviously like the guys need to um find like the perfect song unless it's already like selected, but Vix always has really like plans everything out really well. And one thing like I feel like nobody really talks about is like Vix has like some of the most interesting choreography choreographies in all of K-pop. Like I never bored watching um Vix perform. They're, it's just so creative how they they always kind of make a story out of the song with their dance. So that just adds up to like the ex experience of them of watching them visually and the song takes it to another level. And here's what the disc looks like. Credits. I'll put this, actually no, I'll put this on um, the pile I have for photo cards since I usually don't like to keep photo cards in albums because I think it's and so um for those who um are wanting to buy this definitely buy it it's very cheap but if you are short on money and don't collect fix and just want fantasy uh um i would recommend waiting till next year and waiting uh, to see if um they they'll probably include it in their full length album um and include Dynamite as well, and the new song, because they usually do that. So if you're just in it for the song, buy that. If you collect Vix, obviously buy this. It's not that expensive. And hopefully the next um, uh, single is just as good as Dynamite and Fantasy. I've never been disappointed by Vix ever. And I'm glad they're doing so well with the sales for um, for, uh, for this and for the other one that they released. So thank you for watching and I hope everyone has a great day. Bye.